Hey guys, so real quick, um, that girl Shay XO, that's her name on YouTube. She was like, I guess we had the same thing. Like, hmm, what can we call our crew? What can we call our fans or our subscribers? And she was like, what's up, fam? Like, she was like, I'm gonna call you guys fam. I like that. We may steal it. That's in the bucket of choices for what we're gonna call it, call ourselves. But anyway welcome back to my channel um i wanted to do a quick show and tell may not be that quick a show and tell of a gift that i got for my birthday and um some things i picked up from walgreens including stuff from the clearance section um but before i start with that first off the birthday vlog was all tore up so i know i mentioned it it might get ready with me but that's not about to happen sorry for that the f it was just a mess but the only thing that was really recorded was the sephora situation but yeah. Anyway, you saw the me get ready with me. You saw us playing bamboozle. So that was pretty much my day. Um, number two, all of the winners of the giveaway. If you guys didn't get my emails, I'm sure you're gonna watch this video. I emailed all of you. I shipped everything out yesterday, and I sent you guys tracking numbers. So, um, that. What else? Number three. thought there was something else I need to let you guys know I guess it's not anyway this look that I am in love with today that I put together if you um there will be a face of the day and reviews on this look coming up later on if not tonight I'll get it up tomorrow but I'll definitely film it tonight um this y'all know my little bin that I keep all the stuff I wanted to try it was overflowing with crap that I needed to try um, that I needed to try that I needed to work with that it's in the it was in the bin and I have on a lot of it today and the look that I came this eyeshadow I'm wearing the MAC pigment that I got in um blue brown I'll talk more about it later my lips this whole everything will be talked about later so definitely wait for that video and check it out as soon as you see it like I'm in love with the lash I'm in love with this whole look and we gonna really really talk about it in the next video so let's get into my birthday. My birthday was amazing. My birthday was actually Wednesday the 17th. Didn't really do anything. Like I said, I went to Sephora. I didn't buy anything from Sephora, but I went to Sephora for like a makeover thing. Um, Saturday, I had like a girl's sleepover. A girl's night sleepover at Nelson's house. He was the only boy there because he lives there. But like we got drunk, of course. We went to the movies. We saw Inside Out, which was adorable. Um, and we just were girls we did facial masks then we watched movies and we sleep over it my friend drea it's kind of like gifts aren't really expected but like my gifts from my other friends were all alcoholic or whatever and drea my friend drea shout out she watches my videos and she gave me like a makeup little bag so i'm gonna go ahead and show you everything i got there and then i'll go ahead and show you what i got from walgreens so she got me she knows i collect the elf the beauty books so i got the new bell beauty book add to my collection I have to get two more things from this collection because they have else put out two new smudge pots one called beauty and one called beast if I'm not mistaken but here is the elf I mean the bell beauty book all right excuse me if you hear buzz it's my air conditioner it is like 100 degrees today in Baltimore crazy it's crazy it's crazy all right and then i got three of the good versus evil um sets one of them i think i have but the other two i definitely do not so this is the eye collection with the palette then we have the eyeliner yeah i don't have the eyeliner set with the liquid the waterproof and the pencil and the lip gloss set great and then drea being drea you gotta know her to know why she did this i am a big oh before i get into that oh dropping crap a couple other things from the collection of bell is the eyeshadow palette that she got me the blush it's a face palette so it has a highlight a blush and a bronzer slash contour situation and three lip glosses, super glossy lip shines. I like the Elf super glossy lip shines. They're just packaged, you know, like Beauty and the Beast type of situation. So, got those. Okay, now, Drea got me 
a crap ton of backups of my favorite items. The only thing that's not a backup in here is the Maybelline Brow Drama. I do... I don't have this. I have the one that is tinted for your brows. I forgot what shade I got, but this is actually the transparent. Who doesn't love a good brow gel? So I got this. And then we got the EOS lip balms. I have, she got me three. I got the honeysuckle and two of the medicate. Ooh, I'm dropping everything. Two of the medicated tangerine flavor. Right? And then the Maybelline Lash Sensational. You guys already know that's one of my favorite, favorite, favorite. Kabuki just walked in. Favorite, favorite, favorite mascaras. And now I have five of them. Two I never used before. Hold on. I'm going to show you. These must be new. Let me know if you've seen them. Two, this is the um, Lash Sensational Full Fan Effect. It's the same uh, mascara, but it's in the shade Black Pearl. And it says Pearlescent Luminosity volumizing mascara so it's like I guess a finish on the mascara a pearlescent finish to the mascara so I actually got me two of those never tried it and then the other three are just the blackest black classic lash sensational I love this mascara um I have it I've already bought I bought a backup before I for before my, ugh, even before my birthday um and then I have it in my kit I use it on clients I love this mascara so um yeah I am stocked for life I also, she got me two, and everything was individually wrapped. Like, Drea takes her time. It was in um, a pink bag, and, like, everything, like, every one of these had a little bow around it, wrapped in tissue paper. Everything was individually wrapped. Drea's awesome. She got me two of the um, L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black. Y'all know I love this mascara as well. So, I have two more of these. Um, and what I'm going to do, I have to redo my travel makeup bag anyway, because it's getting a mess. So a lot of this, I have some duplicates to go in there too. But two voluminous carbon blacks. Two more of my Dream Wonder Fluid Touch Foundation. Like she pays attention. Y'all know I love this foundation. Two more in coconut. So one is going to go in my travel makeup bag. And I'll have two more backups. Because I already have a backup. So great, great, great. And then four, which I haven't used this in a long time. But I'm going to pull it back out and use it. Because this was... And still is one of my favorite foundations, the Maybelline Dream Matte Mousse. The girl got me four of them. Because I will say, when I was looking for this and I was obsessed with this, I could not find my shade, which is Coco Dark 3. Because, of course, they don't always carry the black shades um, in every store. So, she hooked me up with the backup sun. I am forever grateful for my friends and of them thinking of me. And, uh, so awesome. So thank you, Drea. Well, I have my air. It's really hot right here. I feel like, I don't know. All right. On to Walgreens. I think there's some family dollar in here, too. I just got lucky in a clearance section. It's not all makeup related at all. But we're going to go ahead and get into what I have from these stores. Mostly Walgreens, but there's some other things. Oh, that's air freshener from Walmart. Um, I got this dollar store. Let's start with the dollar store. I got ponytail holders. Do you care? Don't judge this Elmo. They had like other Sesame Street tins, but this is called the Sesame Street tin box. And it, I got Elmo. I thought that was the cutest. And I got like five of them because two reasons one I want to carry my business cards in which I'm about to show you guys we're gonna carry my business cards in and um there's a dollar store get a little magnetic sheet from Walmart and you have little travel pallets that was another idea so I got five of them one dollar so I'm gonna do things with those um is that it oh family dollar Cosmetic applicators. These are the um, called the vanity pack. They are Q-tips, but one side is pointy. You guys know one side looks like this, and that helps me clean up my eyeliner, my eyeshadow. I love these, and they were on clearance for a dollar and twenty cent. These are actually more expensive than regular Q-tips. Like this pack, this little pack of them cost me like four bucks. Um, 
well this one says three bucks but they can get expensive so a dollar and 20 cent for 285 i bought three boxes of them plus i use q-tips to clean my piercings i use q-tips for is that it but it's enough so i got three boxes of those all right, on to Walgreens. I only found one of these. I would have put all of them. Real Techniques, the Miracle Complexion Sponge that I love, that is like the second best beauty blender. A do Come on, Candice, $1.49. It's already $5.99 or $6.99. Walmart, Walgreens, it's already cheaper than the beauty blender, which runs at $20. Bucks. But for $1.49, and it is comparable to the beauty blender this is the only one i saw i would have got all of them and probably given one to you guys there we go okay um i'm j jumping back and forth from clearance to non-clearance i guess because it's a lot of crap um all beauty really this all right you guys know i use scotch tape a lot of times to make my wing and this one was two dollars it's a magic tape dispenser so this little high heel shoe, and I thought that was cute to sit in my vanity. People are like, why you got tape on your vanity? It's to do my wing. Two dollars, so I got it. Um, you guys know I have my planner that I live by and everything. So it's a lot of office and school supply stuff um, there. So I got some highlighter tabs for a dollar and seven cents. I got two packs of deco tape, duck deco tape, kind of like washi tape, and they were fifty-four cent a piece. So I got this green pattern and this pink pattern. Why not, right? And then these pens are the ones I fell in love with. These are the big neon ink pens. And I already bought a pack when school started, way back before my last semester. And I used them to write notes and everything, but they were like $10 at my school bookstore. I bought them because I wanted them. I never saw them anywhere else. And they have like liquid, they're liquid pens. I ran all mine out. The liquid ran all out. And I have not found them at any other store. And I'm like, where are these pens? I thought maybe they were exclusive to college bookstores or something. But no. So I'm in Walgreens. $2.12. And so I got two more packs of these neon inks. Like, they're awesome. For my planner, you know I color code everything. Alright, and then I have three nail polishes. As you notice, my long nails are gone because I had to do a piercing. And the nails just weren't cutting it. They were only long for my birthday. But y'all know how I go back and forth with my nails. So it's not a big deal. Um... I got three polishes from Sally Hansen. This is the patent, I guess, by patent leather. They were $1.49. I got this shade Chic, which is a great looking nude. And then I got Motto, which is a red. And then this is Sally Hansen's Lux Lace Nail Color. Like, it's supposed to look like lace on your nails and it's in the shade intimate which i am very curious as to how this lace is gonna look and then i got six of these sinful colors hot tips they were 49 cents well not hot tips yeah wait no they're not called hot tips they're called neon appliques i guess um this one the i got three of each this one is called the Hot Tips because they make like a French manicure type of thing. I got three of these. And basically what I'm probably going to do is make like that half moon manicure because my nails aren't long. And then I got this neon set, which I thought was so pretty. This is what it looks like. So yeah, and then I had, I got, this isn't clearance, but you know Milani has come out with 10 or 8 new matte color sensational lipsticks to add to their matte line of them and I got two I got number 70 in matte fearless that's what that looks like and then I got number 74 matte darling beautiful so, is that all? Oh, my business cards. They finally came in. So, if you guys don't know, I am a freelance makeup artist. I've been doing it for a couple months now. Um, you know, like legit business wise and going legit as far as the taxes and keeping receipts and, you know, like really invested in this. And I'm very, very excited. Um, my friend Morgan, I went to UMBC with her. She's a graphic designer. She was like, you want me to make your logo? You want me to design you some cards? I'm um, design you 
a design so you can put on your cards. And I was like, yes. So we went back and forth with ideas and I love them. They're fairly simple, yet they I think they speak speak volumes. The name of my makeup artistry business is Candace Victoria Makeup Artistry. Um Victoria is my middle name. Candace is my first name, in case you guys did not know. Um, and that's why I changed my name here on YouTube to Candace Victoria. You can still find me youtube.com slash sweetlightcandy3 because you can't change the URL. But I am Candace Victoria now. And um, so this is what the makeup, the business card looks like. There, there's a white, I have a white and like baby pink version of this, but I like the black and red because I'm more sultry, romantic, sexy, I like that. So this is the front of my business card. And this is my logo, Candace Victoria. And then the makeup artistry, okay? And then the back is everywhere you can reach me which my email I don't have a phone number on here because I don't have a business phone I just I rather correspond through email um and yeah so my email Candice Victoria makeup at gmail.com it's the same email that is linked down below if you guys want to get in touch with me because I count YouTube as part of my makeup business now and as a part of just my business endeavors because technically I have gotten paid from YouTube so um yeah that makes any sense so and then my instagram my twitter and my youtube is on here a while ago i don't know if i told you guys but i changed my instagram name to candace victoria makeup my twitter is at c victoria makeup just because i wanted everything to be the same and i got these from vista print and i got 500 of them plus shipping for seven bucks for about 32 dollars there was a code for 30 percent off um, so yours can be even cheaper than that. Remember I got double sided and I got a glossy finish on my card. So I have a lot of other products which I'll definitely invest in as I get further and further into this. But I'm very, very excited about that. Um, if it wasn't official now when you got a business card, it's official. Um, anything else I want to say? No. Thanks you guys so much for watching. I love you all. Um, I will talk to you guys in the next one. I'll see you guys later on tonight. Um, I'll record tonight the face of the day and reviews, but it'll go up tonight or tomorrow. But anyway, I love you all, and I will talk to you guys in the next video. If you have any questions or any concerns or anything about um, anything, hit me up. I love you all. Bye.